Gauge theory gravity GTG is a theory of gravitation cast in the mathematical language of geometric algebra. To those familiar with general relativity, it is highly reminiscent of the tetrad formalism although there are significant conceptual differences. Most notably, the background in GTG is flat, Minkowski spacetime. The equivalence principle is not assumed, but instead follows from the fact that the gauge covariant derivative is minimally coupled. As in general relativity, equations structurally identical to the Einstein field equations are derivable from a variational principle. A spin tensor can also be supported in a manner similar to Einstein Cartan Sayama Kibble theory. GTG was first proposed by Lazenby, Doran, and Gull in 1998 as a fulfillment of partial results presented in 1993. The theory has not been widely adopted by the rest of the physics community, who have mostly opted for differential geometry approaches like that of the related gauge gravitation theory. topic mathematical foundation the foundation of gtg comes from two principles first position gauge invariance demands that arbitrary local displacements of fields not affect the physical content of the field equations Second, rotation gauge invariance demands that arbitrary local rotations of fields not affect the physical content of the field equations. These principles lead to the introduction of a new pair of linear functions, the position gauge field and the rotation gauge field. A displacement by some arbitrary function f x x equals f x display style x maps to x equals f x gives rise to the position gauge field defined by the mapping on its adjoint h a x h a x equals H F minus one A F X display style bar M A T H S F H A X maps to bar M A T H S F H A X equals bar M A T H S F H F caret minus one A F X which is linear in its first argument and a is a constant vector. Similarly, a rotation by some arbitrary rotor r gives rise to the rotation gauge field omega a x omega a x equals r omega a x r minus two a r r display style bar m a t h s f omega a x maps to bar m a t h s f omega a x equals r bar m a t h s f omega a x r caret dagger two a c d o t nabla r r caret dagger we can define two different covariant directional derivatives a D equals a H plus one two Omega H A 
Display style a c d o t d equals a c d o t bar m a t h s f h nabla plus f r a c one two m a t h s f omega m a t h s f h a a d equals a h plus Omega H A display style a c d o t math call d equals a c d o t bar m a t h s f h nabla plus m a t h s f omega m a t h s f h a or with the specification of a coordinate system d mu equals mu plus 1 2 omega mu display style d underscore mu equals partial underscore mu plus frac 1 2 omega underscore mu d mu equals mu plus omega mu times display style math call d underscore mu equals partial underscore mu plus omega underscore mu times where times denotes the commutator product the first of these derivatives is better suited for dealing directly with spinors whereas the second is better suited for observables. The GTG analog of the Riemann tensor is built from the commutation rules of these derivatives. d mu d nu psi equals one two R mu new psi display style d underscore mu d underscore new psi equals frac one two m a t h s f r underscore mu new psi r a b equals R H A B Display style math call R A wedge B equals M A T H S F R M A T H S F H A wedge B Topic Field equations The field equations are derived by postulating the Einstein-Hilbert action governs the evolution of the gauge fields, i.e., S equals one two kappa R minus two lambda plus L M debt H minus one D four X Display style S equals int left one over two kappa left math call R minus two lambda right plus math call L underscore mathem M right debt M A T H S F H carrot minus one mathem D carrot four X Minimizing variation of the action with respect to the two gauge fields results in the field equations G A minus Lambda A equals Kappa T 
a display style math call g a lambda equals kappa math call t a d h a equals kappa s h a display style math call d wedge bar m a t h s f h a equals kappa math call s c d o t bar m a t h s f h a where t display style math call t is the covariant energy momentum tensor and s display style math call s is the covariant spin tensor importantly these equations do not give an evolving curvature of space time but rather merely give the evolution of the gauge fields within the flat space time Moreover, the existence of the spin tensor does not endow spacetime with torsion. Topic: <laughs> Relation to general relativity. For those more familiar with general relativity, it is possible to define a metric tensor from the position gauge field in a manner similar to tetrads. In the tetrad formalism, a set of four vectors E A mu display style E underscore a caret mu are introduced. The Greek index mu is raised or lowered by multiplying and contracting with the spacetime's metric tensor. The parenthetical Latin index a is a label for each of the four tetrads, which is raised and lowered as if it were multiplied and contracted with a separate Minkowski metric tensor. GTG, roughly, reverses the roles of these indices. The metric is implicitly assumed to be Minkowski in the selection of the spacetime algebra. The information contained in the other set of indices gets subsumed by the behavior of the gauge fields. We can make the associations G mu equals H minus one E mu Display style g underscore mu equals m a t h s f h caret minus one e underscore mu g mu equals h e mu display style g caret mu equals bar m a t h s f h e caret mu for a covariant vector and contravariant vector in a curved spacetime, where now the unit vectors e mu display style e underscore mu are the chosen coordinate basis. These can define the metric using the rule g mu nu equals G mu G nu display style G underscore mu nu equals G underscore mu c d o t G underscore nu. Following this procedure, it is possible to show that for the most part the observable predictions of GTG agree with einstein carton syama kibble theory for non-vanishing spin and reduce to general relativity for vanishing spin. GTG does, however, make different predictions about global solutions. For example, in the study of a point mass, the choice of a Newtonian gauge yields a solution similar to the Schwarzschild metric in Gullstrand-Painlevé coordinates. 
General relativity permits an extension known as the kruskal shikars coordinates. GTG, on the other hand, forbids any such extension. <laughs> 